Okay, so we have here the Unity U18C. Uh, this uh, instrument can measure AC voltage and uh, maybe also a DC. We will test. I'm not sure about the DC. Uh, what is nice about it is that we have uh, two handles and two, uh, two probes and the two probes will just connect each uh, to one side and what is nice about this one is that we can test three phase the RST connection and this is uh, given by the left and right left and right means uh, probably uh, the current and the voltage uh, phase degrees between them uh, and the phase uh, as you probably know there is a 120 degrees phase between uh, each uh, phase and uh, we can know what is the arrangement of the phases also we have LEDs that by the LEDs we can know uh, the voltage automatically and also we have an LCD that we can read the real voltage we have a hold key we have a flashlight which give a LED out if you are in a dark environment we can also connect these uh, two probes together like this so uh, this is nice and uh, this is the probes cover so you can have it like this I have to mention one thing uh, it looks like it doesn't have a battery but it does it have two batteries two AA batteries here you just need to unscrew one screw in order to replace the batteries and it is also written battery two AAA on the rear cover of this plastic and uh, that's all it can measure up to uh, 700 uh, volts by the LEDs and I think uh, till uh, yes just uh, the cut is till uh, 690 volts we have cut 3 and cut 4 till 600 volts and the frequency by the way is still 400 hertz and uh, that's all so we will uh, test it and see how to use it so the first test I want to connect it to a DC to test so I have in these probes now 24 volts exactly so I will connect it uh, and see if it is capable to measure the voltage so uh, now connected it to the props just a second this is tricky to catch it uh, okay so by the way if you have this problem this rubber uh, can get off so if you want to touch the props in a better or more uh, let's say convenient way so you can remove the props so now I will connect the 24 volts and hope you can see this so 24 volts it is written exactly on the display and we have also we can see a, a right left by the way if I'm pressing this button it changed the output so the left and the right in AC they change in DC this doesn't work okay I will show it later in AC voltage now I will change uh, the polarity so we can see now the left left meaning uh, okay we can see that the polarity is written on the left on the L it is a plus okay so uh, so the L is the red one yes the red is the L now I will change again the polarity 
and now the right the right is the uh, the minus ah, okay so this is the right probe and this is the left probe right and left so the right is now connected to minus so the right probe is the red one yes now the red the, the right is connected to the minus okay so we can we have a reading and also a display so now let's connect it to a real AC so I can touch the AC and if you can see we have this is three phase home so we have uh, the voltage between the, the phases is 389 volts we have uh, the LED still 400 we can see also the L and the R, L and R are changing this is not very understood to me ok we can see now the L is fixed now if I will press the button It doesn't do anything, okay, so I don't really know the meaning of the button. You can see that it is AC, it is uh, doing uh, all the sound because this is a dangerous voltage. So I will try maybe to zoom a little so it will be uh, easier to see the LCD display. Okay. Just a second. Okay, so again, I'm touching between two phase. Hope you can see the 389, the LEDs, the sound, and the L. Now, if I will flip between the phase, so it will be. it will be the R that is connecting so now by the LEDs I can know by the L and the R I can know which is what phase and to detect which is the R which is the S and which is the T and that's all hope you enjoyed this one bye bye